so we can really see because when your hair is wet or damp it has way more definition than it does when it's dry so as much as it's doing nice things right now like i can literally feel the coils coiling um <laughs> I can feel them forming and stuff like that, but um, we'll see if the coils will remain coily and kinky when the hair is all dry. Right now, um, I just want to go ahead and do the rest of my head, but that's basically how you apply it. You first have to make sure that your hair is nice and wet, apply some leave-in conditioner, then go in with the oil of your choosing, and then you can go in with the product. And when you do put in the product, you just have to make sure that you apply, really apply it into the hair, just, you know, and work on as small sections as you can. Y'all, look, it's curling, it's, it's getting defined and stuff. Like, look at this one. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and apply uh, the product to the rest of my hair. And I will be back and we can talk about if it worked, if it didn't work and all that kind of stuff. All right? it's a little bit too thick for type 4 hair personally I feel I feel like if your hair is more curly than kinky um, you'll probably love this product uh, secondly I am really not a big fan of how long it takes to dry oh my gosh I don't know if it's because of all the product that I had to use for this method but I have been waiting for this product to absorb and dry and I just feel like it's been two hours. By now, all the product should be gone, but it's not. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I can already tell from the results that I should have used more of the Sculpting Custard. Um, I used half the packet. As you can see here. I used half the packet, you know, and it achieved some curls, but I can see from that first section that I started with, Obviously, I applied more over here because it was in the beginning, but I can see with this over here that if I had applied more, I would have achieved a curlier result. But also, I don't want to apply more because I feel like I've already applied enough, you know, and I'm just, yeah, like. I just feel like I'm gonna have to wash my hair in a couple of days like I won't be able to go through the whole week because the product buildup is already yeah it's already there I mean it's not there obviously because I just applied it but I just feel like I'm just I'm just honestly I just want to wake up tomorrow and see if I'm gonna need to apply more product tomorrow or not and if I don't have to apply more product tomorrow that means that we are good I guess uh, in terms of product build up um, so you could probably apply more right now my hair feels very soft very bouncy um, yeah I like it now nah. I like it but um, it, it, it I'm not sold you know I like it but I'm not sold I feel like people with looser curl patterns will probably love a product like this and the consistency as well. Uh, but yeah, for people with kinkier hair, it may not achieve what you're really trying to achieve. And for me, I don't really think it's um, every day 
moisturizing styling tool i think it's more of a like you know you want to wear your hair on saturday and you want to wear the shrinkage but you also want to get your curl on and stuff so you apply it for just that day and you know that in a couple of days they're going to wash it out but yeah um so far eh, i like it i'll probably use it again because i have to go to an event on saturday I have to go somewhere on Saturday, so I'll probably use it again then. But after that, I am not. I'm not sure if I'm gonna repurchase it. But yeah, um, I will give it a second. It is a good product, but I feel like they oversold in terms of it's for thick curly type for hair. I think that was a little bit of an oversell, um, even when you see the consistency of the actual product. But anyway, it does. A job okay it does somewhat of the job so I think we should be able to give this seven out of ten um, if you guys have tried the product and maybe I didn't do this properly let me know in the comments let me know how you guys do your wash and goes because this is literally the first time that I do this kind of wash and go usually I don't apply this much product or styling products in my hair so yeah let me know in the comments anyway we are done I really hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, what else do I want to say? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to watch all the ads. And don't forget to share this, okay? Don't forget to share the video. Um, until the next time, I'm going to see you when I see you. Peace.